MDC Alliance leader Nelson Chamisa yesterday said dialogue remained the only solution to rescue Zimbabwe from its deep socio-economic crisis and put the country on a recovery path. Chamisa said it was time for ZANU-PF to stop being selfish and agreed a genuine dialogue to allow Zimbabweans to rebuild their lives after years of suffering. It's no longer time for insults, Chamisa told the Standard. We cannot be experts in trading insults, while other countries are experts in trading commodities. We need real surplus, and not a surplus of anger and hatred. We need total change in communities, in government, in our economy and social fabric. We have no time for games, we have no time for partisan goal scoring, and we need a national game plan. Dachamissa said anger was simmering in the country due to growing and widespread poverty, hence focus must now be directed at addressing the challenges. We cannot be sloganeering and electioneering all the time, he said. Nobody is happy even in ZANU-PF, the MDC alliance and all the other parties. Nobody can be happy when the pockets are not happy, when the stomach is not happy. The only solution for Zimbabwe is to think straight and stop being selfish. The only way is to make sure we have a common denominator, a back to each other moment. But the MDC alliance leader insisted that, though dialogue was the only solution, to end the crisis in Zimbabwe, he would never join the political actors' dialogue polid, platform set up by President Emerson Nangagwa after the 2018 harmonized elections. That, polid, is part of the problem. You cannot try to score cheap political points like that. The only solution is dialogue, and you cannot run away from it. We can run away from it now, in five years, or in ten years but it is the solution that can build our country. It is time to take back our beloved country. Nobody is in charge. We only have poverty in charge and suffering. We can't allow that. There is hurt and violence all over, and we need a humane government. Dacha Misov had earlier taken to microblogging site Twitter to declare his readiness to govern and bring total change to the long-suffering Zimbabweans. Total change, we must turn things around. We just don't have the luxury to be general. We can't just be ordinary. To whom much is given much is expected. Good to go and ready. I will not disappoint, he tweeted. Chamisa has been meeting MDC Alliance grassroots structures across the country as his party gears for the 2023 elections. This week he is expected to tour Matabeland North. 